<laughs> hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. For today's video, I'm going to finally be watching Men in Black 2. I watched the first Men in Black, honestly, maybe six months ago, a year ago, I don't know. I just know everybody loved the first one and a lot of people had mixed feelings about the second one. When I went and looked at the rating on Rotten Tomatoes, it was like 38 or 39 percent, but 90 percent of people liked the movie. I don't trust these reviews. They're so split. They're so weird. But I've heard a lot of people say that it is the worst one, which I don't know if I can believe that because I've heard so many people say it's one of the best ones. So we're going to find out today. But if you're new to the channel, thank you so much for taking the chance and clicking on the video. But if you happen to like the video and, you know, want to watch along with me for the full length commentary and to see and have access to my full length review, the link to my Patreon will be down below in the description. So be sure to check that out as well. Thank you guys so much again and let's get straight into the video. Okay. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. I wonder what year this movie was done, actually. I'm a bit curious about that. A quasi-government agency known as the Men in Black supposedly carries out secret operations here on Earth in order to keep us safe from aliens. Th oh, yeah? From one of their files that doesn't exist. And how would you have it, then? How would you know? The leaders of Zartha flee their planet in order to escape the clutches of the evil Kylothian Serlina. Zarthans bring with them their greatest treasure, the light of Zartha. They didn't have to make the aliens so hot. <laughs> teach the men in black to hide the light from Serlina. And they trust the humans with that? The men in black subdued Serlina, allowing the Zarthans to escape so they might hide the light on another planet. Serlina, released from her captors, vowed that the light would be hers. The people of Earth were once again saved by a secret society of protectors known as the Men in Black. He said the title of the movie. My guess is that is actually a true story and it's gonna be the basically whole plot of the movie. Tommy Lee Will Jones Smith. What a name. <laughs> what a font. So there's an angry, very angry, Johnny Knoxville is in this movie. So there's a very angry, as I was saying, there's a very angry alien on, on that ship. And it is, it is just killing. <gasps> Who are all these big names? Why are there so, I mean, I don't know why there's so many big names in this movie, but that, I didn't realize there's going to be so many big names. I didn't know any of them were in this movie. Oh, it's going to be exciting. <laughs> <laughs> Army. Army. What a terrible dog owner. Why can't you just hold on to the leash? I hope Harvey's okay. He better be okay. There's something I really don't like about this. And it's all of it. I hate all of this. Oh my gosh, it's pooping out stuff. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, it's so tiny. Oh. The heck? Is it gonna eat the paper? Because that doesn't have nutrition. Uh, alien, I don't know what to tell you. It's the alien from the, the story, Sarzan's land. Yep, that name. SARS. That's the alien's name. He turned into her. So we have a Victoria's Secret model just walking around. It is good. What the heck? He literally had to have seen her head being formed and he had no problem doing that. <laughs> he deserved it. Yeah, you too. So did she just take a big poop? Did she take a dump? Is that what just happened? And now she has pants and boots. She has good posture, I should fix mine. So now we have Serlina the alien posing as a human. Awesome. Patrick, hi. hi. 
Uh, you know our arrangements, Jeff. You don't travel outside of the E, F, and R subway lines. In exchange, you get to eat all the inorganic garbage that you want. What the hell are you doing here, <gasps> worm? Jeff, uh, excuse my partner. <laughs> And how are you gonna hide this from everyone? And how did he get into the Men in Black? You're getting big, Jeff. What would you been eating? He he's eating garbage in New York. It's just everywhere. What do you mean? He's eating good. He is the actual subway. He is a train. Sweet dreams, big boy. I see where they got the inspiration for <laughs> the Stranger Things monster. It's New York, it's normal. Sweet. Transit authority people, please move to the forward car. We got a bug in the electrical system. They're kind of playing it sloppy. No, 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 sit down. Sit down. It's only 600 foot worm. I'm Captain Larry Bridgewater and I decide what happens on this train. Oh, oh, you decide. <laughs> made a decision. Yeah, Larry you need to take his ass in there. <laughs> Don't make me do this, Jeff. I guess everyone's going to the museum. Nice place in Manhattan, why not? Get off right in its Central Park, why not? How a man gonna come bashing through the back of a subway when- That's the problem with all y'all New York. <laughs> oh, we've seen it all. Oh no, a 600 foot worm, save us Mr. Black Man. He just wanted to complain. Thank you for participating in our drill. Hopefully you enjoyed our new smaller, more energy efficient subway cars. He's doing good right, his well, job. Station closed. Emergency drill for your safety. Believe these putts. Yeah, it would be a lot worse, honestly. That's like the nicest they would say. Oh my gosh, Museum of Natural History. There's the the planetarium. Beautiful. And there's so many times. You ever feel like you're alone in the universe? Yes. <laughs> hey, let me buy you a piece of pie. Really? What an offer. Same. That's amazing. Please, shut up, Charlie. There's Johnny Why Knoxville. Constantly talking behind my back. Whoa! Who, who are you and how'd you get in here? You like egg salad? I forgot. Yes, he was in this. Hey, Where's the light? Here's the deal. You've been all over the universe looking for this light thing and we found it. You want it, it's gonna cost you. you Where it. is the light? We could find the light, but we tracked it to a guy who might know where it is. That's gross. Don't like that. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> Man, what is wrong with you? You're gonna neuralize me. No, I'm not. Why did you join MIB? Six years in the Marines. I like to serve, I like the action. I like being a hero. Then you joined the wrong organization. <laughs> <laughs> he is making a scene. How long have we been partners? About one. Five months, three days. Get married, have a bunch of kids. Okay. <laughs> okay. Your buddy's kind of shy, but he thinks you are hot. Aw, that's nice, actually. He's helping him out. People will look at that plaque years from now, you know what they'll say? Wait, she looks very familiar. You deserve it. Bring up a case of Mountain Dew from the basement. I'm sorry. Ben. Please, whoever you are, don't hurt me. Where's the light, Ben? I don't know what you're talking about. Did Bruno open the door? How did they not see her? I'm running out of time. Where's the light, Azartha? You're too late. What? Tomorrow at midnight, the light will leave the third planet and be back home. Imagine seeing your boss get whipped into nothingness. It's on Earth, and I know who's gonna tell me where it is. I guess you now own the pizza place. <laughs> you have inherited it. You got this. Do well. See, you neuralized another Ooh. partner. They don't live up to his standards, that's why. Will somebody please explain to me why I have a dead Tricranoslav going through passport control? That'd be my fault, sir. Please don't neuralize me, sir. The hell is that supposed to mean? I think, um... He's just known for it. Good work in the subway. I remember Jeff when he was yay high. I'll be in the gym if you need me. He works too hard. Why don't you take T with you and make a report? T? See, what, what, what happened with T? We, uh... Passports, no rush. How to hang in, Jay? You have got to stop neuralizing MIB personnel. <laughs> Frank. You need a partner. I'm cool. I'll be his partner. What? No way. <gasps> Lose the suit. Sure thing, partner. They put a suit on a dog. I just walked in to find you here with that sad look upon your face. I should have changed that stupid lock. Walk out the door. Frank. Just turn Bring around your head now. In this window before I roll it up in there. He's not welcome anymore. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, cringe. Just play music. So I say we do the good cop, bad cop thing. You interrogate the witness, and I growl. Oh, no, wait. How about we do the good cop, dumb dog? Such a good doggy. What do we got? There's a phosphorus residue on the wall and floor. We've sent samples back to M for analysis. Witness? Girl. Saw everything. I think I better handle this one. You got it. Alone. The whole talking dog thing might be a bit much for her right now. Yeah, I can imagine. Why don't you tell me exactly what you saw? I saw a two-headed guy and a woman in leather. Caucasian? Gray, with tentacles that were coming out of her hands, and she used them to the rip- skin off of his body. Actually, it's not skin. It's a protoplasma polymer similar to the chemical makeup of the gum you find in baseball cards. You need pie. <laughs> what? He really likes pie. You okay? An hour ago, a man I've known my whole life vanished right in front of my eyes because of a woman with things coming out of her fingers. So yeah, everything's okay. <laughs> I know what I saw. You tell me what I'm supposed to believe. I like her a lot, and I think he does too. Ben was an alien. So were the people they killed him. Now, I don't know why they did it, but I promise you that I'm going to find out. It's a very good answer. Quick, sweet, to the, to the point. I'm sorry, uh, I'm gonna have to. Uh, Kill me. No, no. <laughs> a little flash and everything goes back the way it was. If I see you again, will I know it's you? I'll see you. Okay, that's very cute. That's very lonely. Oh, he doesn't wanna flash her. Don't do it, don't do it. Okay. She is gorgeous. Don't do it, Excuse I'm me. so glad he didn't do it. I'll flash you some other time. Who let the dogs what? Oh, he's so cute, it hurts. Tell the girl you love her. I'm supposed to take advice on love from a dude that chases his own ass? Interesting jokes we got here. Talk to me. It's Kylothian, Class C. Selena. Old girlfriend? She wishes. The witness said that the perps were looking for the light of... Zarza, this makes no sense. The light's not on Earth. Now, are you sure this light isn't still here? Positive. Well, let's ask the agent. Can't. He works at the post office. <laughs> Close enough. No. No, wait, is it... Oh, Agent K. It's too bad you wiped out his entire memory of it. Oh, my gosh. Bring him in. They're bringing back Agent K. Stay. That's a good dog. Hey, listen, part. I may look like a dog, but I only play one here on Earth. Whoa. Whatever, wipe your mouth. Hey, babe. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Brown paper and triple twist twine. Okay. C. Express mail to there. Kevin. <laughs> Kevin, that's funny. You just, you don't have like a... <laughs> you don't remember me, but we, we used to work together. I never worked in a funeral home. You are a former agent of a top secret organization that monitors extraterrestrials on Earth. There is a free mental health clinic at the corner of Lilac and East Valley. No way. There was no coma. It was all a cover. Who are you? question is, who are you? I'm the postmaster of Truro, Massachusetts, and I'm ordering you to leave. <laughs> what? Are they all aliens? Oh, oh gosh. I don't like that. I hate that. Yeah, the first, uh, the first one was the worst, I'd say. Just about everybody works in a post office as an alien. No smoking. He's taking this very well. When you look up at the stars at night, you get a feeling deep down in your gut like you don't know who you are. Like you know more about what's going on out there than you do down here. That's why your wife left you. That's messed up. Yeah, that's a line you don't cross there. You decide you want to know who you really are, you come take a ride with me. Yeah. Okay, how's it hanging? <laughs> He's handling all of this very well. I, I can give him props. I would have lost it. See you, Kay. I'm a bit excited to see this, actually. I want to see how you react. This all just looks like a Universal Studios ride. Maybe I could buy you a cup of coffee sometime. Here's some of the old war stories. Uh, black with two sugars if you're going. An honor. How'd it go? Zed, the Jolox are gone and the treaty is signed. Michael, Michael Jackson? Wait a minute, that's not what you promised me. You're, you're breaking up. Zed? Can't hear you. Hello? I'll call you back. I can be Agent M. <laughs> Agent Michael Jackson. I would absolutely love to watch that. Frank? Yeah? I'm gonna need them together on this one. I'm looking for a new assistant. It's not field work, but you get better dental. Dental? You're gonna need it. What's this? Oh, it's lost! Don't touch that! I didn't do anything. Hands 
in your pockets. It's like he's retraining him entirely. Your favorite weapon. Bat? Let's go put it on. What? The last suit you'll ever wear. I don't like the way that was said. That was... <laughs> the deneuralizer. In a few moments, transverse magneto energy will surge through your brain, unlocking information hidden deep and dormant that could hold the key to Earth's very survival. Okay. What's that thing? The deneuralizer. <laughs> The way he reacted. Oh, no, not liking that at all. I felt so weird. If you must with go these out aliens. during the daylight, only the East Village. Only the East Village? Because that's where you'll blend in. Name and planet of origin Cylon Gorth, planet Yorn. Reason for visit? Education. I really want to learn how to be an underwear model. They told me I've got real potential. <laughs> Wake up, I don't like any of this right now. She infiltrate. Oh, that sucks. Okay. They can't like laser her limbs off or something. Breach. We're being firewalled and flushed. Flush. Yep. Fl they were in a toilet. This looks like a nightmare. I wouldn't want to go down this ride. Don't you drown? You would drown. Yeah. Yeah, man, back when you was an agent, you used to love getting flushed. <laughs> Weird. You can't quit on me now, Kay. I saved the world. You tell me why I stare at the stars. Kind of cute, actually. Does that come standard? Actually, it came with a black dude, but he kept getting pulled over. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> that was funny. Communicator, Frank. Where are you, partner? We got flush. Who did it? Some hot looking biker chick. Stay where you are, I'll keep in touch. Yeah. Well, she found K. Neuralized. What? But he was here to get the neuralized. Is she gonna, like, be suspicious of the dog following her? Is the deneuralizer thing the only one? Only official one. Plans leaked out on the internet a few years ago. Computer, internet, deneuralizer. Perfect. It's an old friend. And he put it on eBay? This man. You, you need to reprimand him. It's legal technology. Hey, Jay, ain't seen you in a while. We need the deneuralizer. He was the last, now I see, I didn't know that was him. He played so well. Remember me? Can't say I do, I'm pretty good with faces. Oh, the great K is a neutral. He stares into his soul. Okay, homie. <laughs> downstairs next to the snow blowing. Why do you have more than one snowblower? Oh, he sells things. That makes sense. I need the light of Zartha, and Kay knows where it is. So, whoever brings Kay to me gets Earth. But she's gonna blow up Earth anyway. Jara, good to see you. I am afraid of him. I'm afraid of, like, everything in this movie. Okay! Let's make it happen, Cap! So he was able to find all this just... Because of eBay. So 2000s. You're back. No. <laughs> that would grow back. It grows back. Oh, <gasps> no way. Realize. Goodbye. Your brain needs to reboot. Give it a minute. Oh, so he's gonna remember her soon. Where's Kay? Kay is officially retired. Lower your weapon. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Kay. How are you, boo-boo? You don't look too good. And you look like crap. <laughs> I take that back. He looked like crap. <laughs> he literally does! He's gonna start remembering. Do these people ever get off their bike? He's no good to us. Penny Lie! Mosh tendrils! Volchinian! What did I just witness? So, you got your memory back. Yeah. What is the light of Zartha? Never heard of it. Cool. Oh, so it slowly comes back. Wait, wait, man, what you doing? I always do the drive. I remember that. You used to drive that old busted John. See, I drive- John? Philly slang. I recognize Philly slang because I lived in Philly. Oh my goodness, that's so weird. I didn't think that would ever come in handy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Zed. <laughs> Look, said we both need the same thing. Have we forgotten the little secret of the light? If it's not off Earth by midnight, it self-destructs, annihilating your little planet. You don't want the light on Earth any more than I do. You win. I can be Agent M. Did he just punk her with Michael Jackson? Hey, hey! 
You can't just do that. You should have stayed on the phone. Been like, Betty, be careful. Next right on 37. 30, 30, right. We're not going back to the MIB. Serena thinks I know where the light is. She broke into the MIB in order to lure me back. Into a trap. Which is exactly why we don't need to be just busting in there, man. We gotta have a plan. I interrogated her. Then you neuralized her. Oh. Stop that, man. No, no, no. No, I, I'm fine. It's my fault. I probably, uh. It's my fault that I walked into the pan you hit me with. The Zarathon was vaporized here, so I'm, I'm assuming that the, the perp was over in this direction. Never He's seen it before in my life. That do the... is a hell of a fish. They didn't see anything wrong with that photo you at all? You left yourself clues. Yeah. You pointing at something. I hope I'm not slowing you down. Now we gotta figure out where it goes. I know where it goes. Well, can... no, not yet. She might be important to me. Smooth. You can stay with some friends of mine. People like you. Kinda. Yay! No. This is Laura. Once you go worm, that's what you'll yearn. I hate that. I've dated worse. How is that possible? Laura is very important to me, to us, to the stuff of me and you, man. So smooth, so smooth. I'm gonna ask you guys to keep an eye on her for me. No problem. My communicator, in case you need it. How forward. Um, oh, watch out for Nebel. <laughs> don't fall asleep. I don't like that. I hate that. Hey, he's back! You are the man who would be king of the train locker. Did I leave anything here? The timekeeper. The watch. I've been looking everywhere for that watch. The clock tower! Oh, no, I got y'all. I got y'all. It's cool. It's cool. Oh, they're really upset. It just says sex and sexy. All oh, hail Jay! Jay. Okay. And no one hears what's happening. Be kind. Be wise. Go back and reconcile your past. Large adult entertainment section in the back. Ooh. Ew. <laughs> Yeah. Why'd you leave a watch? To remind me, I guess we have till midnight. It's all about to make sense, kid. Uh, is this card valid? This oh. card hasn't been used in years, before I was born. She looks familiar. My name is Newton, I run the place. You need professional help, son. He's getting it, it's not working. <laughs> like the Zartha. Their Eagle Scout Agent J caught me siphoning the Earth's ozone to sell on the black market. Whoa, <laughs> I wonder why. Give me J, we'll call it even. Groovy. Groovy. That's so 2002. Is that you? Yes, Mom. I'm up here with some friends. I want to have your baby. Gentlemen, before I play the tape, one question. What's up with anal probing? Aliens travel billions of light years just to check out our- Boy, move. From one of their files. Devastating war of Zartha had raged on for 50 mm. years. Looks like Spielberg's work. Joke's on you, it is. Led by the Keeper of the Light, Lorana. Princess Lorana. He loved her. Was that his wife? Tell me Lorana was his wife. If Serena takes the light, it's the end of our world. Where is it? Go go. Oh, never mind, it wasn't his wife, but he does remember her. You never sent it off the planet. You hid it here. Oh. I know I'm right. Take her to Cambodia, get her a lobster dinner. The second y'all get back from Cambodia, move your bum ass. <laughs> Boy, you like 40 years old. Boy, you like 40 years old. And uh, there ain't no such thing as aliens or men in black. You wanna go to Cambodia? Yeah. Hey, mom. No! Why did he have a shovel in his house? Are you wearing a bracelet? Yeah. Is it glowing? No. He's never done that before. I'm very confused what's happening. How, how is she? Found the light. Got it, Jay. Oh. Where's Laura? It might be headquarters. Selena has the bracelet. Why'd she take Laura? She also wants me. Your ship is ready. Send it to Kylo's now. Let's make it hot. No, no, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Not the hot dog stand. Open your mouth. There's some free food. <laughs> he didn't even eat it, whatever. Get to the launch pad on the roof. The bracelet shows the departure point, and no matter what happens, do not come back for me. Okay. Okay. Jay! Hello, Jay. Long time. Be there in one minute, sweetie. Over our dead titanium bodies. Two minutes. <laughs> Hate this. Don't like it. <laughs> He's so scary.
These remind- those remind me of like the big dude from Jack 2. Except he was massive, but he did go around on that thing. His leggies didn't work or something. No, it was a big chair. Not similar to this at all. You are under arrest for being that ugly and for making that many copies. Thirty seconds to launch. Fifteen seconds to launch. And ten seconds to launch. What? Five, four, three, two. He's so confident. Terminated. Half the time you're on your back. That's how I fight. You've lost. There's no way it was that easy. Of course not. It's never that easy. We don't get to that departure point in 11 minutes and 15 seconds. That race is going to go nuclear. Oh, that's wonderful. Hello. Oh. I feel like it's going to be very difficult for them to erase all, all these people's memories. Okay, here we go. Automatic climb. He doesn't operate at hyperspeed. You know what? Move. Ah! <laughs> She's like so weirded out in the backseat. She's handling all of this very, very well. How is there no one in the subways? Hang on. Oops. Running out of time, Kay. Where is the light? Right here. Wait, what? 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 No way. You have a planet to save, Laura. You are going to save a world. I'm a Libra. You're Zarthan. When you get sad, it always seems to rain. Well, lots of people get sad when it rains. It rains because you're sad, baby. What about her family? It was all fake and stuff? Oh, the pizza shop owner. Poor Agent J. I feel so bad for him, I could cry. I finally like, felt hopeful. Or like not alone and he loses her because she's an alien. We are who we are, even if we sometimes forget. Oh, like I like that message actually. I really like that, that was cute. Jeff, I am so not in the mood for you. That's not good. No, Laura, you have to go. And she's not even moving. Felt the latest smack down on your candy ass. If you don't go, we all die. I would be so afraid. Oh my goodness. Good luck, girl. She handled she's handling all of this swimmingly. Thanks for bringing me back. No problem. So Lara is Princess Lorana's daughter. Did y'all It might be the mess. Let's go, kid. Was that his daughter? Was that what the gun does? Never mind, it's what the statue delivery does. We've all been there, kid. The girl is gone, and it hurts. You want to talk? No. Hell, you miss her. It happens to all of us. And when our bodies were entwined in the positions of the Kama Sutra. Zed! <laughs> they really want it. Right, right. I really like that they're all trying to have like dad combos with him. Want my advice? No. No advice, no talking, hell no. All guilty! Oh, you put them rats in my locker. <laughs> we need to let them out of there. I mean, they need to know the world is bigger than that. They're actually in a locker in Grand Central, but what? Okay. So I just finished watching the second Men in Black movie and it is honestly different than the first one. The first one was phenomenal in every way. It was hilarious. The story was great. I love the concept. The way that everything was brought into light and just kind of built up into itself was great. And it felt like this movie kind of, it just didn't have that same charm. Granted, it was good. It felt like Men in Black, but it just didn't have the same charm. It did not have the same like grabbing attention. It just felt like it was sort of made because it had to be. It was good. Um, would I watch it again? Probably. Eventually. But it's not something I would really take like as seriously or to the same extent as the first Men in Black. You know, that one was just a classic. So there were little things, little details that they did handle pretty well. But overall in all, I felt like the story was... 
I don't know, it wasn't, it didn't capture you, it was just sort of like happening. And then there were some funny moments. So that's all I can really say about it. I wouldn't, it was not, not nearly as good as the first one. It was still pretty okay. You know, I don't hate it, don't love it, but it's hard to live up to the first one. So it was still pretty enjoyable. It was like a light watch that you kind of watch with your family. It was pretty cool. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.